So I promise to you that I'm not exaggerating when I tell you that by the end of this video, you'll know how to combine SaaS, AI, and no code uh, building to your agency or just to make money online. The first step you're going to do is to pick a niche. After you pick a niche, you're going to find out what the problems and what current solutions they have. All right, so I hope you guys are writing this down. Then you're gonna need a list. You can come over here to create a list of the businesses in a specific niche. So for this example, I'm gonna tell you the niche that we're going to use. All right, and what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, use this list to promote the new SaaS occurring according to those problems and those current solutions that we created using no code and AI software. So boom, I chose the car dealership niche for this example. And all I did was, I want you guys to follow me, okay? So all I did was go to Google, you can go to ChatGPT for this as well, and list of software that every car dealership use. So now we're gonna copy these. First, I need to open up ChatGPT. Make sure you guys are taking down these notes. Follow every single step so you don't miss a thing, Aerosmith voice. So these are some of the software. Watch this. We're going to place this list of software into ChatGPT real quick. Then we're going to come over here and we're going to get this other list, top 10 car dealership software. We're going to place it in here. Then we're going to ask ChatGPT. Now, make sure you guys are using your own mind for this. I hope this is getting exciting for you. You can see where we're going. Then I'm going to show you the, the platforms that we're going to use uh, to create the AI says and combine it with the no code situation can promote these to these dealerships or to whatever niche you choose to with the list that you created from the AI software that I just showed you earlier. This is super exciting. So do a gently sidekick to the like button and a high unbox knee kick to the share button. Okay. Now, what we're going to ask ChatGPT is uh, give me the pros and cons of each of these software. I guess you guys can't see me typing. So let me put that down there. Each of these software plus the current we ain't going to say that because I don't have the uh, up-to-date version of ChatGPT on this computer, plus the prices of these software. Okay, so now while that's happening, let me go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. So if you chose the niche or whatever already, this is what it's going to look like once this software is done scraping the list. And it's going to scrape from social medias. It's going to scrape from LinkedIn, Facebook, groups and everything. And it's going to get you the actual emails, names, numbers of the people that you're reaching out to in that specific niche. So this is just an example right here of what it's going to look like. It's going to come out in a CSV file. So you do not have to go ahead and, uh, you know, start trying to, you know, convert the files or whatever. So it gives you the names of the people, gives you the numbers and all of that stuff like that. Boom. So we got all of that. So how are you going to be reaching out to them? Um, you can reach out many ways. I strongly suggest you go through email, you go through text, you go through voice and you go through DM, whatever way you have to, you want to get this going because by approaching with your own software, it doesn't matter that there's no code guys. Like, you know, this is the new age where everything is pretty much template by approaching with your own software, you divide and conquer. So what do I mean by that guys? That all of these uh, uh, car dealership companies, whenever they get DM from another marketer or something like like that is just about marketing right but if you're approaching with a replacement for the the stuff that is the worst parts of their day like the stuff that they have overhead for what you guys got to understand is offline businesses have something called overhead these are monthly and annual expenses that they can't avoid. It literally uh, is mandatory that they have to run their businesses with these certain expenses. So we're going to start with something that we can replicate, which is software. All right. So now we got ChatGPT over here. It gave us the pros and the cons of all of these software. So now we know that now what we can do is come over here to a no code uh, SaaS uh, builder right here. So this one is a little bit more complex. And I'm going to show you guys, you keep watching. I'm going to show you one that's less complicated to learn than this one. So even though it's no code and you don't have to know how to code to build platforms on here or apps or whatever on here, it's still a little bit of a learning curve. So what can you build on here? We're going to log in and I'm going to show you the templates. The good thing about this, guys, is it has templates for pretty much any type of SaaS, any type of app or website or something, all of the best ones that you can think of. Airbnbs, uh, Uber, uh, DoorDash, Instacart, all of that stuff. So let me log in. I'm just log in with my Gmail or whatever. I hope this is getting exciting to you because if you have an agency, now you know, oh snap, 
everybody uh you know charges one to two grand for some facebook instagram bull crap or some lead gen agency bull crap now when i approach them i'm i'm more of an authority now so what you're going to do is you're going to click on templates so when you approach them you're going to be way more of an authority figure because you're approaching with an asset and i always tell you guys if you ain't got cash yet it's because you don't own no assets now watch this look here is a platform that they have uh that you can use this is a template for project management like all of these guys all of these offline companies these real businesses they need organization so we got project management then you can create them dashboards so you just want to come through here and you want to find the template that is uh, uh you know similar to the list of the softwares that they commonly use and you already know the prices for them let me see if chat gpt was able to get the prices uh let me see i'm not seeing the prices or whatever okay so what you'll do is you'll find the prices for them or whatever so what you want to do is once you find the template so as you can see look they have one for airbnb so if you're reaching out to like uh you know people that are on airbnb or whatever and or, or whatever okay now this one is powerful look at this e-commerce crm so you would just come over here and you would like use this right here so you would go find the names of facebook groups and stuff over here that have to do with like e-commerce you would put the name of the e-commerce group inside here and then see as you can see it says enter keyword that's where the name of the group will go then you would tell it to guys my name is terrell i've been in uh, david's program for about a month um i just closed my first deal last week for about twelve hundred dollars um we have another one coming up for about another 1200 i'm so excited to be part of his group it, it's truly it's been incredible like the calls just everything everything that i'm learning from the seo to just how to market just a completely different spin on business or i I'm, I'm on a little walk right now um but it's a completely different spin on business i appreciate him so much he's so knowledgeable such a great guy to have in your corner um yeah, he's been probably one of the best mentors I've ever had. I've only been been around him for a month, but just the knowledge, the game that you get from him is incredible. Um, I mean, you can use these skills in any other business to really help scale and lever and leverage leverage yourself. I know like, he's big on leverage, and I'm myself. I'm learning all about leverage, so it's been it's been a absolute game changer to be in his program. So I would get in his program ASAP because you're missing out on a lot of money out there. People are leaving a lot of meat on the bone, and guys that the guys and girls that are in this program. Are going to be feasting off of it so i'd get in the program asap if i were you thanks guys take care it's great me you would type in a number of emails right give me three thousand emails from that group right and then you would choose the country and then you would cl uh, click on search and then within a couple minutes to an hour maybe you'll have like those three thousand e-commerce emails or more right so like it's super powerful you can literally play the magic game so now when you approach these people like look at this it's a whatsapp web uh clone um you can clone a social network and reach out with that okay so when you reach out to them now guys you're going to have something uh like different all right, you want to be different. Stop trying to be in competition with people. Stop trying to be in competition with other agencies that's been around forever or have a bigger, better, uh, um, <laughs> bigger, better rep uh, reputation than you. Maybe they have more um, testimonials than you. Maybe you're just starting out. But this jumps you ahead of everybody because none of these guys really have their own softwares to offer. When they approach all they're telling about them, uh, telling them is that, oh, we can get you more clients. But what if they don't need more clients or customers? What if they need organization better? Or what if the, the softwares that they're using is faulty or old school and needs an upgrade? This is, look at this a pipeline software with the crm you see what i'm saying like like oh like this is crazy so you literally you look dating app like tinder but that don't have nothing to do with what we're talking about um you guys can come over here and, and check it out when you want to all right chat gpt clone okay so you'll just find the ones that are are related to whatever uh um, the niche is that you will go to like even if they want to do video conferencing for uh with their employees instead of them paying for zoom or something every month or going on google meet with it whereas all faulty you can give them their own video conferencing app right and brand it with their brand and everything like that they don't have to pay anything right like come on look you can give them their own pos system or you can create your own pos system like square up right and get paid from the uh the the you know transaction fees now let's move over here i want to show you something because you guys are going to need a script too for this right but this is softer this is a different uh platform that's similar but let me show you the, the templates they have this one is a lot easier to like learn how to use with the templates now watch this watch this just right off the back i think you guys see three that would be extremely valuable to these companies client portal so a lot of this a lot of the time they don't have like these offline businesses don't have organization they don't have a way uh, other than slack nowadays is coming up you know what i'm saying to talk with the members of their teams their staff for instead of doing a staff meeting they can you can build them their own client portal and it's already template but they don't know that <laughs> i mean you template it you uh, slap their brand on there you change the colors you add some different features make it better and, and all of that extra stuff look boom you get paid way more this is how you can get 30 to 50 grand from each of these companies up front not from 
from the marketing that you're doing from them, of course, that's the icing on the icing on the cake. Because if you set up some organization for these guys, they'll be able to handle more customers or clients. But right now, if you toss a lot of customers to certain people that don't have organization, they'll go out of business because they'll be overwhelmed. So look at this client portal. Then they got applicant tracking softwares. Like, come on, like, <laughs> and this is all no code. Like, you don't have to know how to code, guys. You can just choose a template, optimize it, drag and drop new features. And now you don't want to just take it as it is. You want to make it like different from the ones that are actually out there, right? Uh, that's why I had Chad GPT look up the pros and the cons, right? All right. So now we come back over here. Inventory management, like tell me that won't be powerful for them. All right. Uh, and, and you just come over here. You can like click on what you want to see. We got custom CRM, boom, customer success platform, contractor portal, uh, KPIs. Like, like this is good for sales. You understand? Like these CRM right here, like this stuff is good for sales and everything. Um, okay. Legal case management. So let's go into a certain niche. All right. Customer support. Ooh, All right. So now we got a customer uh, feedback situation right here. We have an employee feedback tracker right here. We have employee onboarding, customer onboarding. All of these are just templates. They're all no like no code. You don't have to know how to do any of this. So a lot of the biggest sites that you guys go to, they're not big sites and all powerful and rich and stuff because of how they were built is because of how they were positioned and market uh, marketed. Right. So we want to make sure we can jump ahead in the game, too, because now you have longevity in the game. So what do I mean by that? OK, let's say that you bring on someone because you're going to do their TikTok or their short, short form content or some some crap like that. Right. They're going to pay you the lifetime value of that person. And, you know, after you come in and do what they do, what you do for them, they're going to realize they don't need to keep paying you month after month. They're going to look at patterns and all of that extra stuff. Right. But they don't know nothing about this stuff. Right. <laughs> so like after they cut you short from the TikTok, after they cut you short from doing their Facebook ads or their SEO, at least you'll still have them locked in on your software, right? So guys, this is like, because if you build this, this you know, you build this for them, you're tagged into them. You get a percentage of a lot of stuff that happens with their business. This is one of the ways that we teach inside agency to partner to plug into businesses so you become one of the owners of the business without ever even investing in the business. That's, they're literally paying you to become a partner in their business. So if you ain't got no cash yet, it's because you don't own no assets. So what you want to do is you want to create a script. I'm not going to hold you guys, but you basically want to create a script. You're going to name drop a couple of these that you know that they're using in the industry, right? Like this, tailor this to whatever industry the niche you chose. Don't everybody do the same ones. Be creative use your own brain jesus right so you tailor it so you want to name drop whatever it is dealer market software all right so you're like yo you're going to list out a couple of the the cons that have to deal with it and then you're going to pop back with the solution right yo they charge this these are some of the problems right but guess what we found a way to fix the problem and we're going to give you a six month free trial to test out this software so that you can decide whether or not you want to switch from dealer blah 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 to uh us right six months and then when you do pay there's going to be a 30 percent discount under what you're paying over there and blah 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 on top of that we're going to handle your facebook or your instagram or whatever that so that's an irresistible offer no risk because they get to try it out for an entire six months all right and that's just an example for me and why would i do something that crazy because i'm that crazy i'm just playing but also you're going to be making money like off of other stuff if you get like remember you're going to be on facebook they're only getting this free trial so you you want to go fishing with bait guys right like when you guys are doing outreach the reason you're not getting any responses is because you don't have any bait what do i mean by that if i'm going to uh reach out to do seo let me just give you an example and they have seo softwares as well all right but let's say i'm going to do seo so i'll type in seo jobs why because this is the pond where i'm supposed to fish you guys will just use this right here scrape a whole bunch of companies and start blasting emails to them and i'm guilty of this too so i'm not judging right uh but you'll just start blasting your services out to these people talking about i do your seo and that's the wrong way to do it trust me by experience i know what you should do like when you do have these lists you treat these lists the same way uh, uh you would do, treat a youtube channel you put out a whole bunch of value first before you ever ask anything so i would set up like a 10 15 email sequence and every day i'm just getting them indoctrinated and and giving them a taste like a drug dealer to where they got to keep coming back to me. And then I slap them with the, yo, you know, hey, we can do this too, right? But now they know, like, and trust you. Treat your email campaigns and your SMS campaigns like you're just telling the news, right? Yo, this happened in Ohio to this realtor. You know what I'm saying? This is how you make it to not happen to you, right? And then you just leave like that. Like you just bring in help and support, right? That's how you do your cold outreach campaigns, all right? And then let them ask you, yo, you sending me all of this stuff, man, like, and all of this, but I'm not that technical. How much would it cost for you to do this for me? That's how you do it. Because that's how it works on my, my YouTube. When I put so much information out there and help you guys, and, and show you guys how to do it. A lot of you guys aren't that technical to implement it or figure it out, or you just think you need an extra uh, holding hand. So that's when y'all reach out. But first, you gotta like know that I know what I'm talking about first. It's the same way. Plus, you need if you're fitting, if you're cold, if you're doing cold outreach, guys. These people never said that they were interested, right? You need to fish in the pond that are biting. So what do I mean by that? Okay, so look, SEO jobs. All right, we'll go to Phoenix this time. We haven't been there in a while. All right, so now this is the pond. All right, so now we'll go to Indeed.com. 
These people, these businesses have literally applied and said that they're looking for SEO specialists. All right, look at this. They're literally coming on here, sleepyhead. I don't know what this is, but they're literally saying that they need an SEO specialist. So go where the fish are biting it. Like, like dog, because like I said, with the code outreach, that's cool the way that you're doing it when you're doing an email blast. That's all right. But if I'm sending a thousand emails out a day, I want a huge percentage of them people that want to actually respond back to me. But if my first messages uh, to them are pitches and they don't know me, they never seen any of my content. I never built any type of trust. They don't know if I'm an authority or not. Even if you have an irresistible offer, it's kind of difficult to make them. You're only going to get the desperate of the desperate and they're going to act and pretend broke, not because they are broke, but because they don't know you and they're going to try to get some type of discount. And then now you're not going to have enough to get them the awesome results that you said in a pitch. So the best way you do that is indoctrination. So use your instantly uh, email campaigns to indoctrinate, to get them like super hype right to warm them up send them case studies send them stuff that they can do send them activities that they can go and try on their own and then they'll be like damn that worked and i don't even know this guy and they'll be looking forward to your next emails and all of that like do it like that i know it takes patience and stuff but do it because then when, when you want somebody to trust you they spend way more money with you trust me i know majority of the, my students they get into they get in multiple of my courses not because they even need it just because they want to be around a little bit more right like that's 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 how it works right i'm giving you all the formulas okay so now you go to where the fish are biting where they actually raise their hand and said they're interested or need some help right so now you're fully equipped with a software right so as so, uh, a matter of fact let's see if we can search it um let's see if we can search it just for the example of this video so we'll say car sales Look, car salesman job. Ooh. Okay, so now we, we got to find Indeed again. Okay, now, now this is better. Okay, so look, we got real actual businesses that put applications or, or, or uh, you know, said that they want people to put in applications and stuff. And the good thing about it is, you know, they have a budget because it's literally on here. It says 52000 to $135,000 a year, eight hour shift, blah, blah, blah. So all you're going to do is send them a message. You're like, yo, <laughs> I guarantee to bring in more. If you hire me today, when you hire me today, I guarantee to bring you better results uh work more hours for less pay than anyone else that's putting in an application boom if you say that they're going to be interested then you're going to say on top of that i bring uh, uh once you hire me i'm bringing on uh, a software that's going to replace uh then you start name dropping the the softwares that they're currently using right there so you're not going to have to have to pay those anymore now come on which other applicant in the world is saying that when they put in an application nobody now, of course, guys, you're not going to work more hours because we have leverage like AI and software and tools and stuff. But like we'll talk about all that. Right. When you get on the dang on Zoom meeting and everything. So now once you you're just going to tell them in the script, yo, uh, what email is this the email that I should. Well, we don't want to ask you no questions. Like I, I was just messaging to make sure that this was the correct email to send my video keyword video resume to. Now, in this video resume, you're going to show them the softwares that they're going to see. You have to have bait when you're going fishing. If you guys never went fishing before, you will be out there all day. Unless you are from the jungle and you know how to spearfish, right? <laughs> you are going to be out there all day with a hook that don't have any bait on it. That's what you're doing when you're doing cold outreach to a list and they don't, they don't know you and you're just telling them that you know how to do this or whatever. Okay, well, see, the way that that would work is if you already did some of the work. Okay, so if you're going to do some cold email and lead you straight into the pitch, you tell them, look, hey. I've already ranked for these keywords and all I have to do is put your name and number on the page. And by the end of the week, you'll at least have maybe five to 10 extra customers come from this entity. Uh, um, just reply back with a yes. Let's get started to this email and then we'll set up a Zoom meeting. Right. Boom. Like if you want to reach out cold, I just gave you guys the game. But you need to fish with baits. Don't just email and tell people your skills. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. Dog, nobody cares. So if you're going to do cold email, lead straight into the pitch, at least already have something. So guess what? If you're scraping a list of uh, uh, businesses in Los Angeles, okay, and you pick a niche, like say, for instance, the, the dealership niche, like we're talking about right now. Okay. So let's say I was trying to get them SEO and I'm using SEO as a bait so that I can get them on the software and all of that stuff that I'm using. Right. So, okay. Since they ask for sales and stuff, what I'll do is I'll go and rank for buy here, pay here. Right. <laughs> I'll go rank in, uh, for buy here, pay here, car dealerships in whatever that city is, right? Once I'm ranking for that, then I'll do a, a, um, a, a ringless voicemail blast to a list of local residents. I'll go scrape the numbers of local people there, and then I'll tell them, yo, we're doing, at this dealership, we're doing a special no money down. Go ahead and come up by 12 o'clock. If you are later than 12 o'clock, then you're going to miss out on the no money down, blah, blah, blah. All right, so even if one or two people reply back to that and tell you what time they're coming up there, boom, you're good. So now you have bait. Now you have a ranking, and you have the couple people that's going up there. So when they go up there, you just track that. So now when you reach out cold, you say, yo, I'm following up on some people I sent there. <laughs> I'm just giving y'all all the game. Okay, so I'm following up on some people I sent there. Okay, what's their names? And you just name the people name. Oh, yeah, they came up. Uh, we gave a couple of them some some cards. All right, we can't give you that information. Okay, that's fine. Um, who can I speak with? 
that can give me the information because I already got their names and number because I sent them to you, right? But who can I speak with so that I can start sending some more people up there? Okay, let me transfer you to blah, blah, blah. Okay, now you're transferred to blah, 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 right? So now your first, their first impression with you is that you already gave them money. Have you ever heard of reciprocation? Exactly, right? So now you say, look, that's not, like, I sent somebody to you the other day, right? That's not all I have for you. I can't buy and gifts. They're going to say, what do you mean? They're in the office already. So you say, go to Google, search buy here, pay here. You guys have buy here, pay here. Correct. They say, yes, we have buy her pay her. Whose number and whose business is that on the first page? Oh, snap. That's us. Exactly. I saw that you were hiring on Indeed for car sales. Before I even filled out the application, I brought you sales. I brought you rankings. And on top of that, I have a software that will replace blah, blah, blah. And I'm not going to charge you anything for it. So that will cut the cost. So I've done everything for your company before you even met me. When can we actually sit down and have a more organized discussion on what else I can do for you? Come on, y'all. Come on. Come on. All praises to God, right? Like, this is where I get that from, right? But I, I love to be able to give y'all all this game, right? So this is what you do. So you give them what they want first. They want car sales, fine. Give them some car sales up front, right? Do it the cheapest way possible. Just scrape the leads of the city, right? Uh, set up a, like a, a freaking event in, the, in your marketing or whatever. Just spend about five, 10 bucks. Like, you need bait, like fish with bait, right? Five or 10 bucks. If you're watching this, you ain't got five or 10 bucks. Anyway, I'm not going to say that, but just come on, stop being cheap. Five, 10 bucks, do a ringless voicemail blast or a text blast, or you can just go on your fa just go on your Facebook page and your Instagram page and take their branding and stuff and say, we're doing a sale today. No money down. Uh, we don't care to credit and just use Canva and create like a dang on fake promotion. At least a, a few people from your dang on Facebook account is going to inbox you uh, are going to inbox you and actually what's going on. You say, yo, just go up there. It doesn't matter about the credit. Go up there and you can even bring a trade in. They're going to go up there. You track them and follow what I just told you to follow. <laughs> And you got it in the bag and you already know the budget. Look at this. Experience sales professional. This is 100K to 120K per year. This is all money going down the line. These people already raised their hand and said they need car sales. And you brought car sales, you brought uh, SEO, and you brought software. So that's how you combine no code, says, and AI and your agency to make a crap load of money. Like you, you can make more than what I put in the thumbnail, but I just wanted to look reasonable for you guys, right? So that's what's going to be inside agency to partner the new one uh, and much, much more. I strongly suggest you guys do uh, a Taekwondo spin kick to the like button and the subscribe button. You can do a one inch punch too. Uh, love you guys. See you in the next